Right, hello, hi, uh, my name is Pete Smith. Uh, I'm from England and I, I live in uh, Suzinji, Kumoto. I've been here for a long time now, 25 years pretty much. Yeah, nice what, what brought you to Japan in the first place? Why did you come here? And curiosity more than anything, yeah. So I love traveling and so I've been like to lots of places in uh, Europe. So France, Germany, Switzerland and just the, uh, the next stage is going to the next continent, Japan. So that's kind of why I came here, yeah. I see. Uh, and how long have you been here? 25 years. Wow, I'm counting, 25 yes. years. Mm -hmm. uh, problems? Well, nothing really. It's been very nice. That's why I'm still here. You know, it's just been a very, very nice uh, time. It's a nice, good place to live. Um, there aren't really any problems, you know. So there's lots of problems in England uh, <laughs> with like, you know, with work or with, you know, maybe things being not so safe. But in Japan, it's just a nice, safe, good place. What problems? Um... Yeah, no, I, I'm really hard to think of any problems at all, I guess, you know. Communication, of course, you know, it takes a while to like uh, to be able to, to communicate. Uh, but even there, you know, it's fairly, fairly easy to, to reach a level where you could talk to, to most people, I think. Can you give me one thing that's your biggest love about Japan? Um, well, two. Can I, can I do two things? Sure. Is that okay? So first love is not particularly Japan. First love is the city of Kumamoto. So that's, uh, I just love this city. It's not too big. It's not too small. There's mountains all around. I love mountains. So, uh, it just suits me absolutely fine. So yeah, so number one is Kumamoto. And the second thing, uh, food. Food, you know, it's just, it's wonderful. Everyone says Japanese food is some of the best in the world. And yeah, it really is, you know. So when I go back to England, as I try to do for two weeks every year, then I miss Japanese food. When I come back here, I'm really happy to be sitting in uh, like uh, going to the sushi bar or or somewhere and just enjoying like lots of delicious Japanese food. Mm. I agree. <laughs> uh, is there anything you don't like about Japan? And just in general, the the heat in the summer. I'm you can see I'm uh, English English boy. I like cold weather. So in Japan, when when we get to June, then we got what three four months of really hot weather. And if we didn't have the air conditioner, then I would say goodbye Japan. I love your food, I love the mountains, but I don't want to die of the heat. So thanks to the air conditioners, then I can survive in Japan. Hello, my name's Dan, Daniel Miner. I'm an American. I was born in Iowa, but I've lived most of my life here in Japan. I'm an English teacher. That's why I came to Japan, and that's what I continue to do today. I've been in Japan now since 1988, so that's 34 years, more than half of my life. That entire time, I've been teaching English at universities here in Japan. Why do I enjoy Japan? Oh, it's the culture, uh, the people, the food, the nature, so many things are wonderful here. There is a flip side to the culture, though, that is a little bit difficult to uh, to get used to. One of the things that I don't like as well about Japan is uh, the way everyone seems to do everything at the same time, uh, all together. Uh, everyone's thinking is so synchronized that uh, when there are holidays, every place is crowded because everyone does the same thing at the same time. And that can be uh, a little bit frustrating. Well, hello, uh, my name is Michael Rupp. I'm uh, an American and I've been living in Japan for 26 years, uh, all in Kumamoto. I came, in Kum came to Kumamoto in 1995, um, in July of 1995. My hometown is in America in Erie, Pennsylvania. Uh, it's by the Great Lakes. There's the five Great Lakes, and one of those lakes is called Lake Erie, and that's my hometown. As I was graduating university, I, I was trying to decide whether I wanted to work in Taiwan or Japan, and I, I applied for two jobs, one in Taiwan and one in Japan. And uh, I figured if one job said yes, I would go, and they both said yes, and then I had to think, which one do I want? And then I decided 
let's try a new culture and a new language. So I applied to the, a job called the JET program, which is run by the Japanese uh, Munkasho. And uh, they sent me to Kumamoto to teach English in Amakusa. And I was teaching English in junior high schools and elementary schools in uh, what was called Ariake Machi in Amakusa. Let's see, what do I love about Japan? So um, the culture is very interesting to me. It's so different, unique, and the people, the, uh, the, the kind of people, the Japanese spirit or whatever, uh, Japanese people, their work ethic, uh, their attention to detail. Uh, Japan is such a safe country. Um, it's, uh, the people are polite. The food is very good and healthy. Um, I love so much about the culture. I love hot springs, going to hot springs. Um, I love just the design, you know, tatami and shoji doors. I love all that stuff. I really love watching sumo. In fact, I just finished watching sumo yesterday. That was uh, exciting. Uh, 